I was reading over the Godot 4 networking articles last week, and there's this cool scene replication stuff, so I thought I'd give it a try. All we need to do is compile the engine. Only, after having my laptop fan scream for a while, I discovered that the scene replication stuff hasn't been merged yet. That's not a big problem, but we will have to compile the original branch. Except that you can't, because Godot doesn't compile anymore. Turns out, this is caused by this random third party library made by Samsung, but don't worry, there's already a PR with a fix. So, we'll just copy those changes into our local branch, and try compiling again. Now, before you all stress out, you should know that this all got fixed in the master branch within a couple of days of me struggling through it. This video isn't meant to be bashing Godot, they're doing an awesome job. Anyway, after all that, we get this glorious thing. It doesn't look like much, but this is network players with a dedicated server. Anyone can join at any point after the server has started and everything will still sync properly for them. And it only takes like 40 lines of code. What's even better is that I don't even need to do any state management. Instead of worrying about calling an RSET or an RPC or newly connected clients, Gnome just does it all for you. Like here, where any player can press this button. It replicates to everyone else on the server and it's magically set up whenever anyone new connects. I was going to end the video here, but I just saw that the master branch is now calling itself an alpha release. You'll still need to compile from the networking branch if you want the scene replication stuff, but I'm sure it'll be in an official alpha in a couple of days. Until then, I guess we're all still waiting for Godot.